Hey Wicked Army, Wicked here and welcome to a Clash of Clans episode. Today guys, we're going to play around with the new updated witches and also the skeleton spell. So we're going to do an all witch, skeleton spell attack, uh, also throw in the heroes as well. Because I want that eternal tomb for the giant bombs for the witches. So uh, let's see if we can get 700 likes for this video because in the last few videos guys, you've been hitting the goal with the likes and that's really awesome when we work together and uh, get that video noticed by everyone else. So. What we're going to do, we're going to attack a Town Hall 9, um, Town Hall 10, and see if we can do a Town Hall 11. I don't think the Town Hall 11 will be that great because of the Eagle Artillery, but we'll give it a shot anyway, even if we fail. So let's go ahead with the Town Hall 9. Alright, so we're going to go up north, because this is a southern teaser, and I can tell there's going to be giant bombs all in that southern area. So we're going to avoid that for now, see if we can clear most of the base with the Witches. I'm going to deploy them all on one spot, I don't care with strategy. I know a lot of people will say, hey, why didn't you drop it on the defense? Or, Wicked, why didn't you drop it on the town hall? You know, people that judge a video every single time and nitpick every single mistake in a video, guys, there's more to life than that. Just enjoy it. Just enjoy the mass skeletons that are coming from one spot. That's what I enjoy. I enjoy something different that you don't see no normally every day. Because this is way too expensive to use um, in a real battle or even farming, so... Here we go, look at those witches up the north there, they're trying to get through this wall. Actually, they're going against the bowler there, so that's really cool. Uh, we've got some witches, skeletons on the side, and uh, we've got a good uh, spread of witches everywhere. We've got left, big bulk of them in the middle, and a couple on the right hand side there. So, I'm saving the eternal tomb for the whiz towers, just in case they knock out the witches, because they're all bunched up in the group there. And I'm going to pop them right about, let's have a look, yeah, we'll pop it right now. Um, I don't want the, the Wiz Towers to knock out the majority of my witches. So I'm in the middle now with the rest of the with witches and the BK and the Arch Queens going solo with a witch over on the right hand side. And we're just going to go down south now and I'm going to be worried because I haven't seen any giant bombs left. So they all have to be in the south and uh, as long as we've got a few witches left um, it should be no problems because I've seen witch raids before because witches don't trip uh, traps anymore so they don't trigger traps even in the new update so uh, one giant bomb could blow up blow up all of them and uh, that can end the raid quickly so uh, there's uh, two more that I haven't seen yet but um, I'm pretty sure there we are here we go boom didn't even matter because we cleared the base before that happened all right this is a replay when I was recording I didn't record my mic so I thought this was a pretty cool replay anyway so I'm gonna show you guys in a replay and I've put everything in one spot. Um, there's no strategy again to this. It's just making it look cool for entertainment. So look at the skeletons though. Oh my goodness. Uh, this raid didn't turn out too bad even though there's no funnel. There's just mass witch. Um, the witch is uh, stronger now but you can still blow them up with one giant bomb. So that's the only downfall about the witch is that it still doesn't trip any um, or trigger any traps or anything like that. So that's the only downfall. So. Um, I guess the bomb tower um, allows the witch to be a bit stronger because I think the clash team was worried about the witch being overpowered and you'd see a lot of mass witch attacks um, around the place. So I'm going to do a video uh, with all the troops versus uh, the bomb tower in the next episode so you guys can check it out before the update and see which troops survive the bomb tower's explosion or or even if it's normal splash damage. So um, what I was did here was I saved the Eternal Tomb for the Wiz Towers so they don't uh, knock out my witches all in big groups there because they're all those two big groups of witches that I didn't want to lose. And uh, I get worried sometimes because all those skeletons die and you see the little ghost figures. And I thought, oh, did all my witches die? But it's actually just the skeletons um, um, all dying off there. So uh, it looks like um, the Arch Queen, so this is what happened, the Arch Queen is starting to lock onto the town hall and we've got some few witches on the right hand side with the grand warden and the arch queen actually knocks out the town hall for me which is amazing good on you arch queen actually does something right for once and uh, we've got a bunch of witches like look at these witches though this is what i mean about they, they could not be back just because of this watch this There's how many witches are there like six or seven or eight there could be like eight witches now okay so we're getting closer to what i'm trying to talk about here whoa one blow up, boom done all those witches are gone i don't know guys i really don't know yet um i know they got a buff and everything but one giant bomb 
Like if they, if even if they survived a little bit, maybe, maybe they would be making a comeback. But I'm not sure if people will use it yet. I'm not sure. We'll have to see when the update comes. All right, guys. This is the last one. We're gonna put all. We're gonna actually funnel this time. We're actually gonna funnel because we want to get the eagle artillery. And uh, we want to get the witches in there ASAP. We don't want them going around the side and the eagle artillery is just shooting at it. So um, I'm going to do a widespread because if I put them in a big bunch, the eagle artillery will knock them all out. Oh, I think it's going to knock out at least. Oh, there's a lot. They're bunching up now. Damn it. Okay, so I've got the eternal tomb. Uh, we need to get to that eagle artillery. That's the main goal right now. Um, unfortunately, I didn't... I said it was going to be all skeleton spell and witch attack, so I can't use any jump spells, can't use any heal spells, so uh, it's just all skeleton and witches. So skeleton spell only lasts at the at the start, so there's no more there's no more spells now. But we just got to get to that eagle artillery, and it, everything should be okay um, for a two star, hopefully. But we're going to knock out that wiz tower. But we need to get that eagle artillery asap. The clan castle defense troops are coming out and oh no, that bowler probably just wrecked most of my witches. And it looks like the Grand Warden is going against the Eagle Artillery, but this is not looking good because um, the Grand Warden does not do much damage at all. So uh, looks like goodbye Grand Warden, looks like goodbye witches and skeleton spell raid. Um, it's nice knowing you. See you later. Look away guys. Look away. Oh, he died. All right. So that's about it guys, I hope you guys enjoy that, it was all for entertainment, um, wasn't strategy, don't use this, don't try this at home, that's what I'm trying to say. If you watch the entire video, put in hashtag Larry Rules in the comments below to let me know that you guys watched the entire video, smack that like button, subscribe to my channel if you're new, and remember guys, stay wicked.